Hi guys, EVP Man with Tablets for Me. And today we're going to do a review and unboxing of a new hybrid stylus, um, the AM Pen Hybrid Stylus from TechMate. And this is a stylus that can be used on any iOS device, tablet or phone, so all the variety of different tablets that are out there from Apple, as well as um, your Android tablets and phones. So let's take a look. So um, inside the box, we'll go ahead and open up the stylus up and just pull it out. We have uh, the stylus and has this little bungee. I'll explain what that's for in a couple seconds. Uh, you have your stylus. And this stylus has a little connection here that you can use to plug the stylus if you'd like into the uh, audio jack of your iPhone or your Android tablet or your iPad. Um, this little extension here, just really what it does is it allows you to really extend uh, the use of the stylus. So again, it's used more or less so that you won't lose it. So I can plug this into my headphone jack, um, attach this to the actual stylus right here, and I have the ability to kind of use it and not lose it. So uh, if you've been to a bank and they have a, or any kind of office and they don't want to lose their pen, you notice that they tie it to the counter. Uh, that way it comes back. So this gives you the ability to do that. If you have a case like I do that uh, has uh, kind of a, uh, a loop where you can actually put your stylus, then you definitely don't need to have that bungee action going on. And you notice that here I have a, a, a case and I have a, a little loop right here. So I would just insert this right here and I wouldn't need the loop. But uh, that's one feature that this stylus has. Now, uh, this stylus is a little bit different than uh, some of the other styluses that we had, and we're going to compare it. I'm going to pull a stylus that I have uh, from another company so that we can see because it's, it's different. At least the material that you see here is different. So let's pull out a stylus and we'll do a comparison. So let's take a look at this for a second. So this is a traditional stylus. This is actually a, a higher end stylus that you find in your local bid box uh, retailers or even online. And um, the tip itself is made out of rubber. Um, so it's a rubber tip. And one of the things that um, you'll find when you're using uh, styluses, what makes a difference between one and the other is uh, how sturdy this uh, rubber tip is and how smooth it writes. So the hybrid stylus um, has a rubber tip, but it's actually inside. And then it has this fiber on the outside. So how does that impact writing? Well, it's kind of hard to illustrate that on a video. So the best example I can give you is this. Uh, have you ever picked up a pen and written with it and you find it that it writes very smooth and you go wow gee I really like that pen because it writes nice and smooth and the ink flows nicely and then you have these other pens that as you're writing it's kinda hard to write even though ink is coming across as you're writing it's it doesn't flow easily and it requires more effort so with the combination of um, the rubber inside and then this uh, this fiber material on the outside it gives you the sturdiness that you want Right, but and the conductive material that you need, but gives you a nice smooth um, and gliding stroke as you use the stylus. This is uh, important for those of you who like to draw on your tablets, or for those of you who like to write on your tablets. So the next thing I want to do is show you um, what's the difference as you use it, and we'll use in this case a, an iPad 2 uh, Retina in this example. All right, so I'll go ahead and start with uh, with the traditional stylus, and I'll go ahead and I'm using uh, Notability on my um, iPad Retina, so I'll go ahead and write on it, and you'll notice how you know the letters come up, and it skips sometimes, you know, just what happens with stylus. Uh, and I'll go ahead again and write the word test, and you, and one of the things just to highlight, you can see that there's there is um, different. Um, I would say thicknesses in my writing based on pressure sensitivity that you get off of using the stylus, right? So we have that example. Now what I'll do is I'll use the hybrid stylus. And one of the things I'll tell you, I don't know if it'll come out on the video, but notice I'm not skipping. Uh, it's a smoother write. So I'll write test again. And again, I'm doing the same thing. Uh, you can see that there's um, different type of strokes based on the pressure that I'm applying on the screen. Well, again, we'll do a test. And I'll bring the other stylus out, do the same thing. And notice how I skipped, right? I'll take this one. Notice that? Again, same hand. And I, again, I'm not doing anything. You know, sometimes you got to push down more in some of these other styluses. So the conduction that comes from the, the rubber is not always that good. And this is a good stylus. This is a, a Wacom uh, bamboo stylus. So I'll write the word test again. Push it down. And now, don't really have to put a lot of pressure here. 
just write the word test and I'll just do it over again again boring but writes well so overall I'd say that from a a smoothness when you're writing on the screen um, the hybrid stylus especially with this fiber uh, tip just provides a, a really nice smooth uh, writing experience very similar to when you think about those high-end ink pens that you just grab them and you go like wow that feels really good all right let me show you something else about that. now the uh, the tip of the stylus can be replaced so what you can do is just by twisting this way you can remove the tip and so if if ever you know the the tip gets ruined or gets snagged because it is fiber you don't have to live with that tip uh, forever what you can do is uh, you can order some additional tips online and then all you'd have to do is just replace it so once you uh, once you remove it all you do is you uh, place it back like this and you turn this way and your tip is back on so for the value and the writing experience I'd say that this is um, a great pen especially if you're looking for a gift on the holidays uh, it's not going to break the bank and again for me and I wish there was a way to get this through the video the writing experience because of this fiber tip is really good it's again the best thing I can compare it to is that smooth ink experience that you have with real nice pens if you have any comments or questions leave it on the YouTube channel and as always don't forget to subscribe and to share this video